Hey guys, so today I've got my latest shipment in from Racketeers. Um, it, for those of you all that are not familiar with them, uh, Racketeers is a company that had huge success with uh, some plastic wire stands. Um, and they have since built a company that is uh, centered around electrician tools. So uh, they are we are a huge supporter of them and they are a huge supporter of us and so they send us uh, gift packages all the time so here is our latest shipment and i'm going to start going through what they've sent us as you can see here there's a whole lot of things in this box so we're going to start one at a time and the first thing that we're going to go over is what looks like a slinky now this is what's called a pipe viper and uh, let me see if I can find the tag for it yep right there's the tag for it so this is called a pipe viper you can cold bend rigid PVC without heating or without your pipe collapsing so you have the option you can heat your PVC conduit and then slide this down inside and bend it or you can just cold bend it like you see this guy here doing and it'll keep it from kinking so saves you a lot of time and saves you a lot of uh, headache so again you wh what i do is i tie a string on this loop right here and i drop it down to where i'm going to be bending my conduit on the inside of the conduit and then i proceed to bend my conduit and it saves me a lot and i just pull it right back out with the string all right next thing we've got in here is what's called a phase tape measure and this is color coded for electricians it says on the front now uh, this particular tape measure is an auto stop so you have to push the push the button to release but what's so what's so nice about this tape measure is the color code so if you see here one and two are black three and four, four are red five and six are blue then you've got 7 and 8 are black, 9 and 10 are red, 11 and 12 are blue. And that helps when you're landing panels. Um, the entire 25 foot length of this tape measure is color coded specifically for commercial and industrial electricians. Now if you deal more with... Uh, uh, brown orange yellow then you do black black red blue just remember black is brown red is orange and blue is yellow and you can use this for anything so when for those days when you've got to land circuit 71 and there's nothing else in the panel you don't have to sit and count on your fingers and toes what color it is you can just pull it out to 71 and it'll show you the color um, also something i noticed about this tape measure is there are three uh rare earth magnets here on the end two small and one large and uh, it also has the rear facing hooks and that is going to be for hooking onto your conduit um, this tape measure has an 11 foot 11 and a half foot standout and it's an inch and a quarter wide so uh, it's got a regular belt clip here um, it's got plastic or uh, rubber edging around the housing so it should be pretty resilient and you just push your button and it comes right back in all right the next thing that we've got here is what's called a plug master and i'm going to be making a video here in a few minutes on this particular one um, so i'm not going to go too much into detail with this but it'll test your outlets and gfcis for proper wiring and it also indicates voltage up to 220 so it'll work on 120 and then it'll go all the way up to 2 220 240. Um, you simply just plug that into the front with the cover off you'll have to have the cover off and you'll plug it in and then you if it's a vertical outlet you can level it perfectly so it takes the guesswork out and if you've got them turned sideways above your countertop then you can level it that way also and it's got these blades that come down the sides to keep you from getting shocked 
Um, before we go through the rest of this box, uh, now's a good time. If you enjoy these types of videos and you want to stay up to date on the most recent tools that have come out or the best tool deals that are going on now, hit the subscribe button down here in the corner and uh, go ahead and hit the like or leave a comment. As much feedback as we can get is awesome, but subscriptions are the best way to help our channel. So now back to our tools here. This is what's called a wire vortex. Now, I'm sure a lot of you have seen this already. Um, you put this on the cover of a four square box and it guides your wire in so that eliminates the need for a second man in the situation um you can you can pull wire by yourself you don't have to have somebody standing there feeding it into the conduit and that's one thing i'm going to say about racketeers is they have several products that are geared at wire pulling and the reason that they've done this is to eliminate the extra labor that's been included in traditional wire pulling so if you go through their website you're going to find multiple solutions for wire pulling so again this is a wire vortex there's the directions on the back simply screw it on your four square cover and start pulling and next we're going to have a ac line splitter with a gfci tester so this is going to be more for your troubleshooting and uh problem solving phase you can plug this into your outlet or gfci and you can push this button right here and you can test your uh, gfci but also the line splitter part of this if you see here it's got a glare on it that x10 and input 120 you can wrap your amp clamp around this x10 and it's going to tell you how many amps whatever you're testing is drawing so the way this works plug it into an outlet plug whatever your device is in the other end and then this right side you can put your amp clamp around and find out how many amps it's drawing so if you've got a i don't know some kind of microwave or an air fryer and it keeps tripping your gfci or it keeps tripping your breaker you can find out how many amps it pulls and how many amps you need uh, to supply that so this thing could really come in handy for multiple reasons um, and especially the gfci tester um, so that covers that and then i've got one more thing here in the box again uh subscriptions best way to help us if you'd hit that subscribe button down there in the corner that'd be great we'd really appreciate it and the last thing we've got here is called the pulley or the pull lee however you want to say it um and this is essentially a toilet paper dispenser for a four square box so a lot of you know that there is holes in the outer face of a four square box this collapses and then sticks in there and that allows you to pull wire without needing another guy again racketeers has very geared toward uh eliminating the extra labor that's that's their biggest driver so uh i've got a lot of their tools and they save us a lot of money so uh again you could take just simply these two device these two uh tools right here the wire vortex and the pulley wire roller and you could essentially pull into two different boxes to one home run and still not need another guy to help you it'll automatically feed in there so that is the wire shipment that or the tool shipment that we got in from racketeers we'll go over it one more time you've got the pulley wire roller you've got the wire vortex you've got a phase tape measure you have a ac line splitter with a gfci tester and by the way the links for all of these tools will be down here in the description so if you click the drop down arrow on the description and read to the bottom of it at the very bottom of the description you're going to find the links to all these tools so if you'd like to buy any of this um it'll be linked down there 
and here's your plug master this is going to be mostly for leveling your outlets um, it takes that guesswork what we call eyeballing um, it takes that guesswork out of trying to level it just plug it in get it right and move on then you never have to worry about it again so or if you've got an older house and people have been plugging and unplugging for a long time your outlets aren't level anymore and this is going to solve your problem and then last but not least, actually one of my favorites in this box, is this pipe viper right here. Again, you simply drop this down in your conduit and space your string to where you're going to be bending your pipe. And simply bend it over your knee or over a, hand, a manual conduit bender like a hand bender. And that is going to keep it from kinking. So uh, we want to thank racketeers for sending us these tools and a lot of the videos we're going to be making on them you can also find on racketeers uh tiktok page or youtube channel so again thank you all for watching if you like anything you've seen in this box there'll be links in the description click the drop down pick whichever one you want click on it and and i encourage you to browse racketeers website and and really look at some of the solutions they have they're they're very ingenuitive and and they're trying to change the way that we've been doing things for the longest time and, and it's saving us money but uh we've got to get everybody on board so click the links in the description go to the website check out see what you want hit the subscribe button support our channel we would greatly appreciate it and you all Thanks for watching and have a great day.